Hello friends, welcome to the Shrakshit channel. In today's video, we are going to see Paneer Gravy recipe. For this, take a vessel, add 2 spoons of oil and allow it to heat. Once oil is heated, add 2 cardamom, cinnamon stick and 1 green chilli. You can increase the count of green chilli according to your taste. Now add roughly chopped to medium sized onion. Sort it well. Keep your flame on medium. Add little salt so that onion cooks quickly. Once onion turns transparent, add to medium sized roughly chopped tomatoes. Sort it well and cook until onion becomes mashy consistency. Close with the lid and let it cook for 5 minutes. Close the lid and cook it for 5 more minutes. After 5 minutes open the lid and add half a spoon of sugar. Sugar balances the taste. If you don't like the sugar you can skip this step. Once tomatoes are completely mashed, transfer into a plate and allow it to cool. Once the onion and tomatoes are cooled, blend into a smooth paste. Now take a vessel, add 3 spoons of oil, bay leaf, 2 cardamom, cinnamon sticks and 3 cloves. And add 1 medium sized roughly chopped onion, fry until onion becomes golden brown. Add 1 spoon of ginger garlic paste. Keep your flame on medium. Add 2 spoons of roughly chopped mint and coriander leaves. Sort it well. And now add the blended puree. Mix it well and cook it for 5 to 8 minutes under medium flame. Close the lid. After 5 minutes, mix it well, add 1 spoon of chilli powder, 1 fourth spoon of turmeric and half a spoon of garam masala, mix it well and add required amount of salt for the recipe and close the lid and cook it for 5 minutes after 5 minutes add 250 ml of water stir it well and close with the lid and cook it for about 5 minutes on a high flame once the gravy started boiling, add paneer here I have taken 200 grams of paneer and cut into a cube shape. Place the lid and cook it for about 3 minutes. Here our paneer gravy is ready. Pack up with 1 spoon of mint and coriander leaves and serve with then ghee rice. Hope you like the video. Thanks for watching. Have a happy day. Don't forget to subscribe.